Hello dear viewer and welcome back to Dark Mist on iOS with me Jalanon. I did not expect to still be doing a run. I figured I would have died by now. But uh, yeah, I think that's one of the like key game design components that I think is really nice about roguelikes sometimes is when it's designed with the player just being able to jump in and feel like they can build something viable the first time. Pirates Outlaws is difficult enough and there's enough kind of bad RNG you can get that that's honestly pretty hard to do. Whereas in Slay the Spire and this one, it feels like you can at least build something that could give you victory or at least get you pretty far uh, the first time you pick it up. So that's just one little thing I'd like to point out is this feels pretty fun because this is level one, not supposed to be the most challenging thing yet. And who knows, maybe I'd just die at the next wave, but yeah. Tentacles interesting. Ooh. I kind of like that. Yeah, we'll take the drinking gourd. I wonder if I can fit more of these props in. Uh, exchange is interesting. Especially since we do like to discard cards a lot. So we will take it. Hmm, monster fang. We don't really need that anymore. We've only got like, what? Five total levels, one more left. So, yeah. Ooh, upgrades are really cheap now. Blue flower. <gasps> Ooh. Well, except not great. Yes, that is great. Coin purse. Uh, hmm. I don't know why we'd pay money for this to obtain it multiple times. Oh. That's interesting. Hmm. I don't think we need it, though. But well, it sounds fun. Ooh, remove the chosen card from your deck, then draw four cards. Um. Hmm. Why not? We'll take it. That might save our bacon. We might level up. Gaining an energy could be helpful on this last wave area. Well, second to last. Uh, what can we upgrade? Uh, we could do... Hmm. Bloody Storm. We'll upgrade you. What else do we want to upgrade? Crushing Blow, dealing more damage, getting more blood. Sure. Delete. Hmm. Eternal Blood has just been good. When we get it, it has been sometimes, you know, too much. But that's okay. Where's our normal strikes? And there's our reckless strikes. Sometimes that's helpful. Sometimes it's not. Uh, normal strikes. There you are. Get rid of you. And we can delete another one. Okay. Delete another one. Okay. Yeah, and also it feels like you can get rid of all the cards you want to get rid of if you choose to do that. So that's interesting. Hmm. But once again, this is level one. Probably at more difficult levels, you get more fodder cards and stuff clogging up the deck. Hmm. So I can exchange throwing axe. That's pretty nice. Vertigo. What? What does that do? Unplayable. Okay. It gets removed when it enters the block pile. Uh, interesting. Uh, blood summoning, I think, will be good. Discard you again, throwing axe. What? Yeah, the lizard knights are giving us vertigo. Curses. Uh, we're going to draw for some cards. Hmm. I think we do exchange. Go ballistic. Okay. We could do the vow. Yeah, I think we just want to get rid of that card from our hand. Let's do that. Shouldn't give us vertigo. Oh, what? Was that from this? <sighs> That's really annoying. 
Okay, discard you. It goes away forever. That's kind of nice. Get rid of you. Hmm. Old Dossier. Ooh. Close quarters. For every point of attack power the target enemy has. Ooh. That's not bad. Do we need it, though? No. And it costs two energy, so that's a thing. Um, so wait. Oh, it becomes one damage. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, so we couldn't use everything correctly because I disregarded the swamp monster, which is bad. Okay. Get rid of that. Okay. Let's get rid of some of these boiling bloods. Then we can do this. Get another boiling blood. Oop. Ah, I missed that guy right there. I noticed that one up there. I got a little too distracted. Okay, we'll do that. And we'll exchange. Okay. Eternal blood. Okay. We can get rid of that constriction, actually. So let's do that. Eternal blood, because why not? Now we have the engine going. Okay. We could crushing blow. Hmm. We got another vertigo. That's not great. Oh, we'll just get rid of you. Can we do this? that. Okay, that was weird. Hmm. Well, we got more energy again. I think we do blood summoning so we can get rid of the vertigo, weirdly enough. And we can use the boomerang for the same purpose. Get rid of that vertigo. Okay, uh, let's do some more damage to him. We don't need to play Eternal Bloods anymore. We have three. I think we crush this dude. What happens if you come up? Okay. I think we want to do this so then they can't attack us from back there. We get a couple Boiling Bloods. Yeah, we do that. Make sure he has less attack damage. And we attack you. We can't exchange again. We can go ballistic. Why not? Okay. Deal more damage to the swamp thing. So we'll do that. Exchange again. Throw the axe again. Yeah. This is working. Um... You know what? We're just going to get rid of the red bag. We'll do that. Get rid of you. Oh, blistering blood. Joyous. Get rid of that guy. Hmm. Let's do this. Get rid of constriction. Give this another energy. I can use the reckless swing to get rid of the go ballistic later. Hmm. We could purify something out. We pretty much never use this card. Something to think about. I think what I'll actually do... Wait, do you draw cards? You do. <laughs> hmm. I'll think about it. But now, though, let's go for the Swamp thing. Swamp Freak, I'm sorry. Okay. Burst into Anger, go Ballistic. It is a good combo, which we don't need right now. <laughs> hmm. I want my double Eternal Bloods for the future turns, but not right now. Maybe I do this. Give it to you. Okay. We can do... How many of these do I have? I have a few. 
Uh, they can help us start the combo off. So you know what? We'll do our combo. That just gives us another space for more boiling blood. We'll do that. Hmm. I think purify was a bad idea. Hmm. I think what I'll do is that. Just to get rid of that. I'm getting some more energy this way. Okay, I've got sweep, so we will play it. And get rid of those two. Alright. The huge freak falls in front of you, and you find something strange on him. Gain XP. Draw two attack cards and choose two skill cards. Uh, or gain ten energy. We gain the energy. Pure force washes over you, and you are rejuvenated. What? Okay. Well, that worked, I guess. A lot better than I thought. <laughs> Let's do that just to get rid of that space. We're definitely blistering blood. That's four damage now. I do want to use exchange on the throwing axe. Yeah. Okay. We can do 15 damage with the bloody storm. And unfortunately, we can't fit that many things in here, so we'll do that. Ooh, we'll need enemy defeated. What do you do? Immediately gain 20 XP. Hmm. Why not? It might be fun. Uh, can I not level up again? That's interesting. Ooh. But that's only as a finishing move. Hmm. Same with you. No, that would mess up our deck, I think. Okay. Well, KO that guy. KO that guy. What do you guys do? Demon Bird. Okay, gains Iron Defense upon receiving an attack damage, so you want to KO it in one hit. Which we could do to one of them. This guy, Mysterious Old Man. Hmm. So it's nice that he resets his attack power over time. So we do want to take out these guys. Good to know. Take you down. Exchange. Get rid of the red bag, or... Yeah, the red bag. Okay. Hmm. Burst into anger, go ballistic mini. Because we don't have enough room. It's a good problem to have, but a problem nonetheless. Oh, we already have another level. Hemorrhage. Ooh. <laughs> that would be really good right now, other than we can't afford it. Uh, we don't need any of these. Okay. Is there another level up, potentially, in the future, or is this our final level? I guess we'll find out. Next time, dear Phil. Let's use a boomerang. I don't need you right now. Boomerang. We'll get rid of this one. <laughs> okay. Demon bird. Demon bird. Sweep allows us to get rid of two things. Let's do this first. So weep. Get rid of you. And, well, I guess we can keep the Reckless Strike. Get rid of the Purify. Okay. Then we can burst into Anger. Get rid of one of these. Boink. Do that. And that. Sweep allows us to get rid of two again. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. And I think, yeah. What do you do? Rebirth upon death, a random enemy in the front row gains taunt. Okay, let's just try to take out the old man. Gain the blistering blood. Now we're doing five damage per hit. Uh, we can do... 
exchange, get rid of constriction. Okay, we can do another exchange. Get rid of eternal blood, we don't need you. There we go. Oh, so there are steel guys with backbone after all. I didn't expect anyone to be so close to the Red Mist. Let me reward you. Would you like to ring my bell? Reject gain 20 XP. Ring the bell. The attack power of all non-boss enemies on the field becomes zero. Huh. I mean, can I even gain more XP? I should have double-checked. Hmm. Yeah, we'll ring the bell. You must be an anxious person. I'll help you this once. Okay, I can still gain XP. So I probably should have done that. Oh well. Iron Beak. You're not so special. I'll take you down, Beaky Boy. There we go. And then boom. Uh, exchange. What do we want to do? Let's get rid of you. Water monster, it gets rebirth. Okay. Let me take out the demon void. Wow, this is a long turn. Hmm. Do we just pay for the throwing axe? Nah, there's no way, right? We do that. There we go. Take out this dude. We do that. It doesn't look like we're running out of energy anytime soon. So that's nice. Right? Right. Discard you. And I'm glad we have those boomerang cards. Those have been nice. Uh, what about you? Steel Quilled Soldier. So, we don't want to KO him until the end, pretty much. So, good thing I double checked that guy out. Hmm. Ah, we see the boss, finally. Shadow Twins. After this enemy attacks, it gains plus one attack power. Once enemy's attack power is odd, your skill cards cost plus one energy. When it's even, your attack cards cost plus one. Hmm. And it does not have to wait a turn to attack you when it enters the front row. Okay. Well, now we know. Hmm. And you discard all cards in my hand. Hmm. Let's do this. Eternal blood, we don't need. Okay. We can just throw that out there. Blowing blood. Is somebody... Oh, we are taunting. Hmm. Does this discard all the cards I just made? Yeah, okay. So, can I draw more cards now? No? No! Okay. Well, that's mean. Hmm. Blistering blood. Eternal blood. Deal some damage. There we go. How we doing? Let's turn down that volume and keep going. Right? Oh, you have taunt. Your iron beak. So, I don't think we're too scared of you. Get rid of that throwing axe. Get rid of you. Okay. Hmm. Let's go for another eternal blood. Hmm. We don't need this red bag right now. Can do that. Maybe we get rid of this thing, because we don't need it right now. And then we can use you again. Can get rid of you right now. Okay. Um, we do that. Get rid of constriction. Use our vow. Hmm. Or do that. We can do the throwing axe if we want, but nah. We're gonna do this. And then we're gonna be careful, because once that happens, we can't get anything really. <laughs> so hmm. <laughs> hmm. 
Maybe if I time it right. Probably not, though. Get rid of the eternal blood. We don't need to do that. Okay, if I use the boomerang... Do I draw the card after? Oh, good. Well, this worked. Okay, good thing we have the energy. I would like to draw more cards. There we go. Exchange. Throw out the throwing axe for free. If we can get more exchanges. There we go. Exchange. Reckless swing. We don't need you. Hmm. We can purify. No, no. Well, we're doing this, and that. We don't want to use up all our energy now because we can't actually use it well. Um, does this purify it forever? Yeesh, I don't know. Hmm. Burst into anger, get rid of the eternal blood. Okay. Now we can find another one of those energy giving cards. It would be nice. Maybe. Exchange, there we go. Alright. More cards, please. Burst into anger, give her a constriction, more energy. Okay. Exchange, throw out the throwing axe. Hmm. Well, I think I have to use an eternal blood here. How weird. Okay. Do that. Hmm. Oh, another vow. We're almost level 21. Uh, we can just throw that out, right? That actually dealt plus one damage, that's right. Okay. Hmm. Okay, now skill cards are worth more. But now our boiling blood shouldn't cost anything, so that's good. So we do that. Then we do this. We have so much blood. Blood. Okay, there we go. Alright. You've unlocked a prop. Yay! Forge's hammer. Immediately choose four card rewards. The available cards will be upgraded. Hmm. Okay. So we cleared normal mode on difficulty level 1 as the Berserker. Victory? Question mark. So we cleared. Highest level was 20. Equipment was 14. Thin skinned. Continuous kill streak 21. Strongest attack 10. Kills 136. 797 gold. Difficulty of 1. Okay, so you can even share scores and stuff, huh? Well, that's cool. So if we go back, just to check. Okay, level 2. Okay. I would like to know if it saves your run. Because that's one thing I don't like about uh, Pirates Outlaws, is you can't really seem to, like, save your run mid-run. Whereas in Slay the Spire you can, which is nice. So, yeah. Let me know what you think of Dark Mist New Viewer. Leave a like if you've enjoyed this. Subscribe to see more iOS gaming videos. Comment below if you want to see more of this and really turn it into a Let's Play series. And yeah, I hope you have a great day. Victory!